hi welcome back to the channel as ever you can find me over on instagram at the house of langford and at overall sews i'm also on ravelry at mad x stitcher and then for i would do a very little um making video i guess i have a couple of these big nitty critter kits so this is flow the flamingo and i did i think i started a similar flamingo a while ago and couldn't quite get the head right so i think i know what i'm doing now and i figured that i would have a go at making up this flamingo so yeah come along with me and make a giant flamingo <laughs> Okay, it has taken me about an hour, but I have a body of Flo the Flamingo. And it's taken almost one ball. So there's three balls in this. I do wonder though if I should have gone down a hook size. I've used the hook it comes with, which is an eight mil. Um but I can see my I can see through the stitches to the stuffing um when I've done my decreases. The rest of it seems fine, but it's just the decrease rounds. So, I'm going to move on now to the head and neck. And then, yeah, we'll see how long it takes me to get.
yesterday I managed to get the body done, the head and the neck and get it all joined. So it looks a bit weird at the minute but <laughs> this is the flamingo so far and the head is very floppy. I have had to stitch a bit higher so actually my this bit ends there so I've had to stitch into the neck just to try and keep it a bit more stable um yeah so I am gonna crack on and try and do some more <laughs> It so they flap and it's got feet very pleased with it <laughs> so this is what I've been working on this is what I have last ready it's a flamingo it's so big it doesn't fit in the camera it's got knots in his knees I do have to hold it though because the head is a bit floppy. <laughs> I've even done it so the wings flap as well. I'm very much very very happy with this project and I really hope my friend um, will like it as well. But yeah it's so it's so easy as well. It's all double crochet. You've got chain loops for 
the feather effect there's some double some increases and decreases um and that is it and then it's just sewing it all together i did get confused when i very first read the pattern about this section but that bit is also repeated down here um to form the s bend in the neck but yeah <laughs> I think this is actually the first nitty critter I've made and I've got a couple more in my stash as well. I have the llama and I have a rainbow project box. I also have a mini pouch pal that I need to work up but I've had this in my stash for at least a year and I wanted to get it done for my friend so yeah that's Flo the Flamingo.